السلام علیکم و رحمت الله و برکاته. اوز بیلای من شیطان رجیم بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم. Start with the name of Allah who is Rahman and Rahim. The topic that is that has been assigned to me from Tarjumah Quran Academy is about organization of Islamic cooperation. In this lecture, we will divide, we will discuss all kind of information about OIC. That what is in, uh, that what is OIC basically. So before starting our lecture. We want to define it that what is OIC basically. OIC, Organization of Islamic Cooperation. It was founded in 25 September 1969 in the capital city of Morocco, Rabat. Its, third, its, its first name was Organization of Islamic Conference, but later it was changed into Organization of Islamic Cooperation in 2011. It was, its name was changed to Organization of Islamic Cooperation. There are 57 Islamic countries in all over the world, in which 56 are sovereign countries, while only one country is an observer state, that is called Palestine, which is not the member of OIC, Organization of Islam, uh, UN, United Nations. And uh, the headquarters of, and there are uh, following two countries that are from South America. One is Suriname, Suriname and the other is Guyana. They, they, are, they both are the only countries from South America. And only one country is from Europe, it's called Albania, and it's Muslim country. And 20, 27 countries are from Asia, and 27 countries are from Africa. They are the Muslim countries that are the member of OIC. Similarly, the headquarter of OIC is located in the famous city of Saudi Arabia in Jeddah. As we know that we, we define that the uh, OIC was founded in Morocco, the capital city of Morocco, Rabat, but its headquarter is located in, in the famous city of Saudi Arabia in Jeddah. Similarly, the second one is background or the causes behind the foundation of OIC, that what were the causes that OIC was founded. The first one was Hindu Pak War that was fought in 1965 during the dictatorship of General Ayub Khan. And the second one was the Arab-Israel War. It was fought in 1967. Keep in your mind that there were following countries such as Saudi Arabia, uh, Egypt, Lebanon, Jordan, and Syria. And uh, Palestine was also the member of in, uh, during Arab-Israel war. They fought combinedly against Israel, but unfortunately they were defeated by Israelis, Israeli forces. And the third one was Al-Aqsa fire. Al-Aqsa fire, th in this case, it was a major cause behind the foundation of YC, because in this, in 1969, Jews, as done as an uncivilized world, they entered in the Masjid Aqsa or Qibla Awal, Bait al Muqaddas, and they killed many innocent people. In this case, many Muslim leaders assembled and they got united and they founded Organization of Islamic Corporation or Islamic Conference. Third one is the objectives of OIC, that what are the objectives of OIC? The first one is to save the holy places like mosque, like Khana Kaaba, like uh, Qibla Awal, Bait al Muqaddas, to save the holy places of Muslims. The second one was to, to help with Palestinians, to help and to, to support the people of Palestine. The, second, the third one is to cooperate with the Muslim Ummah in their economy, in their freedom, in their education. And the fourth one is to remove all type of hatred and discrimination between the Muslims, among the Muslims. These, these four were the objectives of OIC, or Organization of Islamic Cooperation. And the fourth one is structure of OIC. There are following three, three structure or three organs of OIC. The first one is Islamic Summit. Islamic Summit is a conference which is held after every three or about than three years. The first Islamic summit was held in the capital city of Morocco, Rabat, in 1969. It was the first Islamic summit. 
and the second one was held in, in Pakistan city Lahore in 1973. It was a great and it was a famous Islamic summit of YC. In this Islamic summit, the great Muslim leaders like Zulfiqar al Bhutto, Mahmoud Kazafi, uh, Yasir Arafat, Anwar Sadat, and Shah Faisal, these all, uh, these all leader, great leaders were invited in uh, Pakistan for, in, order to, uh, in order to join this summit. And last summit, it was 14th summit that was held in Mecca in 2019. It was last Islamic summit. And this, in this uh, Islamic summit, the aid of the state or the prime minister of a state is invited in this conference. This is also, and the second one is the Islamic Conference. This conference is held after each year. In this conference, only foreign minister of the country is invited. Last time, it, this conference was held in Pakistan, in the city of Pakistan, Islamabad, the 22 March 2022. It was 48 Islamic Conference of YC. In this Islamic Conference, the Foreign Minister of China was also invited as a chief guest. Similarly, the third one is extraordinary meeting. It is also called emergency meeting. Keep in your mind that then when the, the government of Ashraf Ghani was called on by Taliban, then the meeting was held in Pakistan. And it was 17 meeting um, that was held in 2021 so that they could help with Afghanis with their education in their economy and in their food uh, to provide them, them food and clothes and houses etc. And the fifth one is Secretariat. The first Secretary of OIC was Tinku Abdul Rahman. He was also the first Prime Minister of Malaysia and also the, called the founder of Malaysia. Prime Minister of founder of Malaysia. And there was only one member from Pakistan, which, which name was Sharif Pirzada. It was first Pakistani and last Pakistani. That was the Secretary General of OIC. And the current uh, OIC Secretary is Hussein Ibrahim Taha, that is on chart. Similarly, the sixth one here is the failure of OIC. What is the failure of OIC? Why OIC is failed today? So the first failure of OIC is Arab-Israel War. This war was fought in 1973. As you know that OIC was founded in 1969, but this war was fought in 1973. In this war, many places of Arab was taken by Israeli forces, such as Golan Heights, West Bank, and Sinai Peninsula that was taken by Israeli forces. But OIC was remained silent. And the second one is Iran-Iraq war. It was fought in 1980. As I told you in a previous lecture that there are following two rivers in Iraq. One is called Tigris and the next one is called Euphrates. Tigris and Euphrates, when they connect on one point, then it's called Shat al-Harab. It is located in Iraq and this war was fought just because of Shat al-Harab between Iran, Iran, Iran and Iraq. These both countries are also the member of OIC, but they fought to each other. The third one is Gulf War. Gulf War was fought in 1991 between Kuwait and Iraq. They were also Islamic uh, OIC member countries. This war was fought in 1991 when, uh, when Iraq attacked on Kuwait without any reason. Similarly, the USA invasion in Iraq. USA, USA attacked on Iran without any reason, without any solid reason, and he break the rules of the charter or the rules of the UN, United Nations. But United Nations and YC both are silent. And the fifth one is Babri Mosque. Babri Mosque is located in India, and this incident was happened in 6 December 1992 when the Babri Mosque was demolished by uh, ISSR terrorists. But nobody take any voice against 
this section. The sixth one is Sulvi attack on Yemen in 2015. Othis are located, Othis are found in Yemen and uh, they support Iran. Therefore, Saudi Arab attack on Yemen and they killed many Houthis in 2015. Keep in your mind that United UAE, Saudi Arab, and Bahrain has become three are became the puppet or the yes men of USA because they are being funded by USA. They do anything for the interest of USA. And the seventh one is Cy Cyprus issue, sorry. Syrian civil war. It was, it was start in 2011. We should feel shame that when, Russia, when Syria was a peaceful country, then there was, there was, it was the member of OIC, but when a civil war and uprising and uh, other uh, fighting was started in Syria, then it was kicked out from, kicked out from the list of OIC in 2011. We should, at that time, we should support him, but uh, support Syria, but we did not support it, but we kicked out from the, uh, from the list of OIC. And the eighth one is Cyprus issue, Palestine issue, and Kashmir issue. Cyprus is located between Greece and Turkey, and it is a disputed area, and it is, this is uh, an island, disputed island between Greece and Turkey, but this issue is unresolved. Palestine issue between Israel and Palestine, it is also unresolved. And Kashmir issue between Pakistan and India, and it is also unresolved issues. Nagro Karabakh, it is a place in uh, Azerbaijan. This is a disputed area between Azerbaijan and Armenia. But unfortunately, OIC, o OIC did not take any solid action against, in the favor of Azerbaijan, as is, is it is a Muslim country. They themselves support, they themselves fight against Armenia and took their area, Nagorno-Karabakh, from Azerbaijanis. And the OIC is just a platform where leaders, Muslim leaders, come after every three years, and they collect to, uh, they meet to each other, but nothing else. Name of OIC is remained, but the action of OIC is removed. We should reform it or remove it. It is not uh, Im improve, or it is not uh, a good organization for Muslim countries. So it was my topic. If you have any type of question, then you may ask anything. Thank you so much.